What's up, everybody? What's going on? Welcome to Jersey Girl Pearls. Hello, hello. Happy Saturday. All right, let me find us. Happy Saturday, guys. All right. One second here. Hi guys, everybody's popping on. I can see that we're a little zoomed in right now, but Jay left the room. A little close up tonight. Happy Saturday. I'm just getting set up here. Let me actually share this really quick. Oh no, just shut up. All right, come on. Look at, it just went black. What does that mean? Here we go. Happy Saturday, guys. I'm just going to share our video really quick. Our share word tonight is Pearl, so hashtag Pearls. Um, I, I wrote it out somewhere. That was last week's. <laughs> I just wrote it out. So we would love if you shared our video tonight, guys. Like and share word is Pearls, hashtag Pearls. I'm just going to share my video really quickly. We would love if you shared our video, too. It helps us get our name out there. So, hi guys, you've reached Jersey Girl Pearls. So, we open oysters to reveal beautiful pearls. We're a small um, company located in northern Bergen County, New Jersey. So, we are right outside of Manhattan. I'm Jen. My husband, Jay, is behind the camera. He's actually left the studio for a minute. Um, he went downstairs to get me my oyster, or my pearl rinsing bowl. Um, if you see a red live button here, that means we are live now. We can interact, you can ask questions, you can order live, and we will open your pearls um, or your oysters to reveal your pearls. Um, if there is not a red button there, that just means you are watching a replay. You can still talk to us, we just won't answer immediately. You can put hashtag replay so that we know um, that you got to watch. So hello guys, happy Saturday. Okay, let me share really quick, write a post. I always dis am distracted because I'm usually talking when I'm trying to share. Join. How was everyone's Saturday? I'm so glad that you guys are on with us tonight. Oh, All right, so we're going to put it to my personal page and then do that. Okay. And I think I think we're good. It's weird because my video keeps bringing up my profile picture like as the video thing is really strange. Okay, but let's see. He's gonna hand me this water and I have my coffee over here. Sorry, <laughs> yeah, let's go Come this on. way. Thanks, love. Hi guys, so happy Saturday. We're so glad that you're joining us. I'm just setting up. A few minutes late today, sorry about that guys. Oh my gosh, so it was 80 degrees in Jersey today. 80 and warm and humid. So we actually have the air conditioner on right now. It's first time of the season. You know me, I get hot very easily. So I was like, want to turn the air on? <laughs> so I'm sure he's probably over the air being on right now, but all right, let me see everything you can see. So you can see my coffee. Let me try to, like I said, Jay's not in here at the second. So let's just see. Here. I'm frozen. Okay, there we go. All right. I think I'm good. I think I'm good. All right. Hi, Diane. Hi, Samantha. Hi, Becky. Hi, Jana. Hi, Samantha. Hi, Kim. Hi, Karen. Watching from work tonight. It's a nice 37 degree. Oh, yeah. Minnesota got. Did you guys get snow? You guys got a bunch of snow, right? Hello from the Oregon Beach. Hi, Marina. How are you guys? Oh, all right, so I tried, I think I'm centered. I turned it a bit. <laughs> I feel like everything's very compact on the, on the screen. How's everybody doing? Happy Saturday, guys. So our share word tonight is hashtag pearls. Jana says, don't need AC in new house. In our new house that we're gonna eventually get or the new house you just built. <laughs> oh. Can you hear that noise? Jay's like, I think he's closing our cur our blinds. 
Samantha said they got six to eight inches. It's melting again. Oh my gosh. So I saw like Instagram posts with tons of snow and I feel like it was Minnesota. So I know you're saying six to eight, but I feel like they, there might've been spots that even got more than that. Oh, the house you built for us. Oh my goodness. Oh, wouldn't that be amazing to move to Hawaii? That would be a dream. I would feel like I was so far from like, I don't know. Like, I think if my, if somebody my, else in my family moved there too, then I might feel, but I love Hawaii. I could, I could live in Hawaii, but I would feel very far. She said Southern Minnesota got more. Oh guys, how are you? She says, just do it. I, do. I know we should just do it. How are you guys doing today? So Jay and I had um, kind of a busy day. We, had, we always have errands in the morning on Saturdays. And then if you guys are part of our VIP club, um, I was talking to, I think, Jana last night to say that uh, he went to um, Home Depot last night. Thank God I didn't have to go. But he went, he was there for an hour because we're redoing our bathroom. So, you know, and we are not... We're, we have a, a friend who's a contractor who's doing it, but um, we're going to get like everything we need. And so we don't know. He, I mean, we have a list, but you don't realize how in depth it is. So he went for like two hours yesterday. And then today he's like, I have to go back. I'm like, do you want me to go with you? I was like, I'll just take another car because we probably need two cars to fit, you know, the new toilet in and whatever. So I went with him and then I was there for, we were there for a, a little while, mm -hmm. but we were able to like, um, you know, because he was like, oh, we'll just, we'll go later. You know, oh, I'll go later. I'm like, you can't do that. <laughs> we have to do it now. We have to get it done. So, um, so we spent a little time there, but most of it's done. There's just a couple things left that he has to pick up. We leave for vacation this week. Um, so our, we, we always book a vacation in the spring and then we go with my family in the summer. Um, so our spring vacation is this week. Yeah. We leave on Thursday. So there's not much time <laughs> and they're actually doing our bathroom while we're gone. So my parents are staying here. So that will be nice because then we come home to a new bathroom and we don't have to live without one. Um, so we're excited about that. It's just that there's so much stuff, you know, when like you're getting ready to go away when there's so much stuff to do. Oh my gosh. Okay. What am I missing? Karen says she wants coffee now. Did you guys see the post I put on about the coffee, the way the coffee looks? Okay. So this is okay for me. I don't know if you could see that. I said C4, but this might be a little bit darker than that. Huh? I put up a post about coffee. Did you see it? He didn't, because he's like, what are you talking about? Jana's sick in bed? Oh no. Hi Trish, hi guys. Kim says 20 inches in some areas for Minnesota. The snow, I mean, I saw it on Instagram. People post it, I'm like, this is nuts. Robin says, oh, I hear the flu is horrible. Take care and get better soon. Um, does someone have the flu? Do you have the flu, Jana, or you're just not feeling well? The flu would be terrible. Honey and lemons, Jana. Don't know if it's flu. Honey Hello from lemons. Missouri. Hi, Yvonne. Hi, guys. So thanks for joining us. So for those of you that are just tuning in that have never seen our show, um, I'm Jen. Jay is behind the camera, my husband. Uh, we own Jersey Girl Pearls. So we um, order our pearls still in the oysters, and that's so that we can open them with our customers. So you can actually order right now, jerseygirlpearls.com. If you order oysters, we will open them, we will measure them, we will show you what they look like, you can take a screenshot of them, and then we will send them to you. If you purchase jewelry, it takes a little bit longer to get to you. Um, I typically say five to seven days for regular jewelry, five to seven business days, and then when you have um, some drilling involved, it can take a little bit longer. So we're going away on Thursday, so anything that's outstanding that we can do, we will do in the next two days and send out. We're pretty good about that or when holidays are coming up that kind of stuff we rush that um but we are um like i was saying we're located in new jersey we're right outside of manhattan so you can actually see the skyline when you're driving um jay and i work in medicine so we work in the hospital uh, monday through friday we do pearls at night and on the weekends um and all of your stuff goes straight from us to you there's no middleman there's what? no consultants say hi to jay guys he's behind the camera he is like and we just got through Joint Commission. We yeah. did very well. So I know I might have mentioned that we were um, expecting, like, uh, the, the easiest way to say it is, like, auditors for the hospital. So, like, you know how I had my huge trauma audit last year? So that is just for my department. It's in order for my department to stay 
um, like a verified trauma center, or my whole hospital to stay a verified trauma center. But the the Joint Commission, if you're not familiar with medicine hey, or, or hospitals, is like an auditor for the whole hospital, every department. So we had it this week. We did very well. But when they're there, it's very um, like anxiety inducing. So it was a very just hectic week. I still um, haven't relaxed yet. Yeah, he's not. You know, because it it's a lot. It's a buildup of you know. Every, they come every three years, but it's a buildup, and there's so much stuff that they cover and you need to make sure everything's good in your department which it, it is but still anxiety inducing so that was our week <laughs> so it's done they were here through friday so we couldn't even really relax last night i know i, I saw people on and um i said man maybe i should have had a party on friday night too but uh, it was just like the end of that crazy audit week so samantha says we love when the joint commission comes no. <laughs> They were very kind. They were very nice to us. Um, but it is very, I mean, you're having someone look at every single piece of the hospital. Like, how do your floors look? How do your walls look? You know, let me look inside charts. I mean, it's everything you can imagine from, like, exterior, interior to charting, employee files. It is everything. So it's a lot. Tammy says, we just had our joint commission, our joint commission, our trauma hospital. It's nuts. I know. <laughs> It's crazy. So glad it's over though. Oh my gosh. So Jay was afraid that they would come while we were on vacation, which is next week. So Sweating bullets. Yeah, he was just I think I mentioned it last show. He was so nervous. But they're here. They came. We're good. It's done. I almost had a nervous break though. And we had surprise pop ups at our offices. Oh my gosh. Well our pharmacy department had like a surprise visit from the DEA on the same day the Joint Commission was there. So I think they were a little, you know, surprised to have two people come at the yeah, same time. Did, yeah, everyone did really good. So it's over, it's done. We can try to relax this weekend a little bit. But can you uh, share if you didn't already? I took care of it. He's on top of it, guys. I didn't hear Jay. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Stop the show. Hi, Ashley. Oh, he said stop the show. Becky said, beautiful day in upstate. I know. It was 80 Stop years. the show. Oh, gosh. Jay says, I have to stop the show. Hi, Jana. I hope you feel better. Aww. Have some chicken soup. That was nice. Now you may continue. Aww. Where's the, where's the button? I have no idea what the button is. That was sweet. Diane said, joint commission doing mock inspections now. Yeah, so we have been doing, like, the mocks and the, um... The tracers and stuff are, you know, it's like months and months in advance. So, Diane feels us. Samantha, it was crazy when they come in. They were here in 2017. So, 18, 19, 20. So, they're coming next year for you. It's crazy. We are a rural critical access hospital. A lot of major traumas go to Sanford or at LaRue Hospitals. Yeah, it's so, it is crazy because everybody, it's just, no matter what, it's just anxiety inducing. But just as any auditor would be for any company or anything, so, or any department, you know, crazy. So we're so thankful. So give Jay a thumbs up and a love because he really was in the thick of it. Much more than trauma is. Trauma is not as prevalent during that. So what is everybody up to? So tonight, guys... If you have commented on our Facebook page at all during the week, this is how our show usually works. We give away oysters during the show. We always give away a first and a last oyster. So the first oyster goes to someone who has interacted with our posts. So we have posts on Facebook that we do during the week. As long as you are commenting, even if you write one comment to something, that means you're interacting. So your name is in here. There's actually a ton of names in here. Uh -huh. And I'm trying to think of all the posts. So we did the coffee post. Oh. The, the best post was, um, I think it said, without revealing your age, name something that someone younger maybe wouldn't understand now. Okay, so I have questions. I missed that too. You did? Uh -huh. Oh, because you, were, you didn't have any time to be online this week. But, okay, so Karen, Karen, what in the world? So Karen was talking about when, she's, when her family didn't need electricity anymore. They like unhooked something. She got a little shock each time she unhooked it. And then you would shut off the electricity for the night and then you'd put it back on the next morning. Uh, what is that? We get Epic next year. So we don't have, Diane says we just went live with the new Epic. Okay, so 
uh, I've used Epic for many years. However, they don't have it at this hospital. So I've been at this hospital for six years. So I've been six years without it, but many years before that in my other institutions with it. So we are getting Epic, but it's gonna be like another year or two. So love Epic. I also love Epic, just like you guys do. Um, I think it's great, and I'm so glad that um, our hospital didn't end up going to that. Um, so what was I saying? Okay, so is Karen on to talk about this electricity thing? And then, wait, Priscilla, Priscilla had one, but I can't remember right off the top of my head what Priscilla said. So I was kind of thinking also today about station wagons, because we always had a station wagon growing up, and like the seats in the back. So some people's seats in the back sat up so that you could look out the back of the station wagon. But ours like lifted up like this, so we looked at each other. Oh my gosh, like you would never have like a station wagon out, or would you put kids back there, right? Because God forbid, like you got rear-ended, but we loved, when we were kids, not high school kids, we loved the station wagon. Did anybody else have a station wagon? I'm trying to think what else, um, people said eight tracks. I had a city um, bus. You had a city bus? Is that how you got to school? Mm -hmm. You took a city bus to school? Mm-hmm. I had a bus pass, yeah. But they didn't have school buses? No. My husband grew up in Queens. So you took a, a New York City bus to school every day? The Q64 every day. Wow. My little bus pass. What? Yep. What? Oh, my gosh. Party lines. I think party... is party lines, because I don't, I don't think we ever called them that. Are party lines the ones where you just click over and then you can add people and everybody's on the same line? Is that what that is? Um, Mine would have been Manhunt. Anybody play Manhunt? Man, is that a like a Atari game? What did you just say? <laughs> Manhunt is that like an Atari game? Is no, that a movie? <laughs> it's, oh my god! I'm walk. <laughs> it's been great, folks. I'm gonna walk away now. We what it? What is Manhunt? Is Manhunt not a game? It is a game. Oh my god, he just walked away. He, he just walked away. We had Geo Metro. Party lines. We did. I had a party line. Yes, I played Manhunt in Brooklyn. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. He, he's like... Thank you. Oh, this is my like and share. Does he's anybody like, know what Stoop Ball is? Please tell me nobody, somebody knows what Stoop Ball is. Stoop She's from Cali. I don't, you call I don't even know what any of this is. And you can hear several. Yeah, the party lines were back in the 80s. Sorry, Jim was like two. <laughs> so she doesn't know about the party lines. Oh, God, yes, party lines. Couldn't use the phone until the other person was done. No, you call a number and you could hear several people talking. Oh, okay. oh, no, I don't know what that is. Oh, my gosh. I was thinking of, like... Three-way We didn't have the party lines. We just, uh, with our first portable phone, you put we used it to up get, to the... no, we used to get cross lines and you could hear everybody else's conversations in the, in the neighborhood. It was annoying. And in the building. In Stoop Queens? ball, yes. Thank you. Stoop ball. Kick the can. Stoop, stoop ball. What is happening? Okay. Karen said, we only had electricity from the power company. So basically off the grid. So we had what was essentially a gas generator that we called the light plant. And we had to turn it off by disconnecting the spark plug wire. And we got shot to who oh, did it geez. out in the dark. Oh my gosh, that is crazy. I've never heard of something like that. That is nuts. Um, I think Jana mentioned milk delivery. So when I was born, I know that we always had milk delivery and we always had a diaper service. So I said to my mom, why did you put like dirty diapers out? And they took them out. She's like, yeah, it was a service. They came and took the cloth diapers and brought the, the other ones. I was like, oh my, can you imagine that? I mean, it's probably obviously better for the environment, but hey, so hey, interesting. Claire. And the milkman, the milkman always came and left it on the porch, I think, or, you know, delivered it. We called the milkman something different if he came to our neighborhood. What does that mean? Oh, my gosh. That's Hi, a, Claire. How are you? Dodgeball. That's a joke. I do remember dodgeball. We never I was her. little, and my grandmother had milk delivered. I'm only 48. So I um, I don't remember the milk being delivered, but I know it was. Like, my, like I just know. Like, we, we always had milk delivered, although I don't physically remember it because I was too young, but didn't have electricity from the power company. So I always thought it was funny because my mom grew up on a farm 
on a dairy farm, which is funny. <laughs> There's a funny story about a cow farm behind that because Jay didn't know they were called da like a dairy farm, so he called them cow farms. Um, and the porch. Ashley, you cut the cord? Like oh my, my mom God. used to, she slept out on the porch. I guess it was like an enclosed porch. Um, but she's like, oh, I was the youngest, so my brother had his room, my parents had their room, and I was on the porch, which I guess wasn't unusual. <laughs> like, I can't even imagine that. So she's like, yeah, it was scary out there sometimes. I'm like, oh my gosh, like, what? And then one of my favorite movies with my sister is called The Man in the Moon. It's when Reese Witherspoon is like five. No, she's like 10 probably. Um, and they sleep on the porch too. So I always think of that when I see that movie, but... We had a bread man, too, and some guy who drove around in a truck and sharpened the knives. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my gosh. If I could go back, right? Don't you want to go back for just a few? I want to go back. I'd like to be like a fly on the wall and, like, see what it was like for the generation before us. My grandma had one of the older Singer sewing machines that you had to pedal. I remember pinching my finger in it once. Then it, they switched to electric. Uh, yes, I do remember that. I got one in the basement, but it's electric. Milk in a glass bottle with a foil lid. Oh my gosh. She was three. We had a long cord and actually cut it when her dad was on the phone. Oh my gosh. I want to go back and find my old big wheels. Jan says, I am, I am old, so I remember all that. The milk was delivered in glass bottles with cream floating on top. The bread man came around, too. Oh, my gosh. Tammy uh -huh. wants to go back. I want to go back, too. What about the fire bucket? We it's live like, in such a I used different... to have a fire bucket. I don't know what happened to it from my grandfather's gas station. My great-grandfather's. What's a fire bucket? Exactly. See? What is a fire bucket? My great-grandfather and my grandfather and his brothers used to own a gas station back in the day. They had, a, they had fire buckets. What the heck is that? What is it? I'm waiting for somebody to... To, to tell you? To tell you. <laughs> They're fire buckets. When I was little, we had a guy drive down our street and sell us produce and bakery, and he sharpened knives. We had egg delivery, Priscilla said. We had Ginny dolls when I was small and played jacks. I do remember playing jacks when I was younger. I didn't know what I was doing, but I remember with the ball and the those silver things. Jenny, you going to make me one? You're going to buy me one? Those were the good old days. Jay, they make big, big wheels. Hmm. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? It's where they put the ash I'm in sure. a fire bucket. This is crazy. Oh, memory no, lane, No, the fire guys. bucket was red, and then it said fire in white letters. And that's how they used to put the fire. If there was a fire, they'd fill it up. it have some kind of either oh, it took, something it put the fire out, or you water mean? or something in it. And they, not, would dump, they would dump it on the fire. It's not water. So if it was in a gas or station, it's probably... Whatever. They had something in there that you'd dump on the fire. Remember Sticky Nutty Putty to the newspaper? Oh, yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Jackson Marbles, for sure. Man, I wish I could remember some more stuff. Oh, those were the good old days, I'm telling you. Just go back just for like a day. It was so simple. No car payments, no insurance. Okay, because you were five, had, you mean? Had hair. <laughs> hair in places I was supposed to have hair in places. Oh my God. <laughs> Give Jay a thumbs up and a love. My mom had one with a set to clean the fireplace. So you put, oh, I know what you're talking about. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, because we had a hearth growing up in the, the fireplace and we had one of those things. Hopscotch. Oh yeah, for sure. Everybody played hopscotch. Chemicals, not water. Never water on gas or grease fire. Right. Silly putty chicken. We had a chicken farm. So, yeah, my mom's, like, the dairy farm she grew up. She had every every kind of animal. Although, I did live across the street from the Queens farm. It's the only farm in Queens. And, is that, and that's where your pets went when they... No, seriously. They had a donkey. But didn't, didn't your chickens. family tell you when your dog didn't come home that... The dog went to the farm? Oh, uh, yeah. It really did go to the farm. <laughs> but yeah. not really. He went to the farm. Aww. <laughs> My mom had, had a time when she had to wash diapers for at least two babies in the river. No washing machine. Then she got a ringer washer. And I remember when we got our fingers stuck in the rollers. She wouldn't pop the roller release, but would just hit reverse. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That is so funny. 
Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is so great. I can't, we could go on for days. Oh my gosh. Um, so what I was saying, um, we can still take, uh, talk about this, but I'm just going to finish what I was saying about this. So we always give away one oyster in the beginning, one oyster at the end of the night. So the oyster at the end of the night goes to someone who gives our video a thumbs up and tells us where you're watching from. So you can say, Hey, I'm watching from Long Island. I'm watching from Florida. You can say I'm watching from my kitchen. Um, you don't have to tell me your address or even the town you're in or anything. Um, you can be as vague or as, um, Holy crap, you got your sister stuck in a top loader? Um, Did you get her out yet? I don't know. Um, you can be as vague as you want. Um, as long as you're interacting with us, your name automatically goes into the name generator. Um, Jay does the name generator usually in front of the camera at the end of the night, and someone will win a free oyster on us, which means free pearl, free shipping. Um, at the beginning of the show, we always give away... Um, the first oyster to someone who has commented on a post on our Facebook page. So we had a lot of posts up, including the one I'm talking about right now, about reminiscing about the good old days. Uh, we had a coffee one. I'm trying to think what else we had. I like my coffee dark and black. Um, so, um, so you might not even realize Shh, Claire, that don't say that word around her. Um. Fireman. Oh. Love those firemen. Whatever. Is that what I have to do? I have to put Jay into the top loader in order to get the firemen to come here. <laughs> He's giving me a dirty look. She'll probably forget to call them. <laughs> no, I won't forget to call them. Uh, Pull my name. You want a green pearl. Yes. Yeah, so uh, let me see if I'm psychic. You will automatically be I... entered into our name generator if you give this video a thumbs up and tell us where you're watching from. Um, our share word tonight is pearls, hashtag pearls. When we get up to 30 live views, we give away a free oyster to someone who has used the hashtag pearls and shared our video. Um, and then from there we go up 10. So when we get to 30, 40, 50, 60, and so on, we give away free oysters during the whole night. Um, so hashtag pearls is the, is the word for tonight. So if you've never ordered from us before, all you have to do is head over to jerseygirlpearls.com or you can touch my face. You should see something that comes up that has our link or on our Facebook page, um, there's a shop now button. You can use that as well. When you spend um, $65, every $65 you spend gets you a board pick. Every $150 you spend gets you a board pick and a wheel spin. So if you spend two $65, so you spend 130, you get two board picks. Does that make sense? Every $65 gets you board picks. Every 150 gets you a board pick and a wheel spin. So if you spend 300, you get two board picks, two wheel spins. Um, the wheel spins are, usually cash, games, prizes, and then all, of course the board picks you can win free oysters, percentages off, free shipping, tons of great prizes. Um, it's all good guys. Awesome. We have lots of fun stuff. Oh yo, Tammy. Janice says life. We gotta talk. In Hawaii is like the good old days, except with electricity. It's so nice. Hi Sandy, how are you? Watching from home in New Jersey. Changing the subject. Jay, we have a pickle place here that you would love. They make hoagies. That's all you need to know. On these huge... Oh, my gosh. Okay, I saw that somewhere. I feel like I saw that. Like an ad for that. Tammy's going to have to send me some. <laughs> I, saw, I saw an ad for that just like yesterday. That's crazy. Upstate, uh, upstate New York in a house. Upstate New York. All the rural farm life. What dreams are made of. From Albany. So awesome. All right, guys, so um, we have two pre-orders tonight. So the first one, though, I don't know if Karen is on. Karen Collis, are you on? So the first pre-order tonight, um, someone actually ordered a pre-order, no, a preset piece. So we're going to do, if she's on, we'll go ahead and do her board pick. Um, but if she's not on, I'll save her and then um, and then do the board pick when I'm she comes on. I'm going to check my orders now. So jerseygirlpearls.com, guys, if you want to order. So we do have some preset jewelry on the site. So if you are on jerseygirlpearls.com, there's, um, you know, like the shop button at the top, the about button underneath. You'll see something, see something that says Mother's Day and preset. So the presets mean that we have already set those pieces with pearls um, and you can order them that way. Instead of ordering them and being surprised by your pearl color, we have a, a few pieces left that we set. So we're probably going to have to make some more. Um, what are you looking at me for? I'm, I'm thinking as I'm looking at you. I'll probably end up having to make some more um, soon and we'll put those on there because we have a lot of holidays and, and I gotta giving paint, times ahead. I gotta paint the molding tomorrow, paint the door. The, I think they'll do that for you. I doubt it. 
I'm going to make sure it's done. I don't want to take any chances. Really? Yeah. Oh, my Lord. Yeah. Um, oh, can you give me some kind of, like, juice or something? Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, what was I saying? So, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So, the preset. So, there are preset pieces there. If you are on the preset um, section and you click on something, but it doesn't let you add it to the cart, it means it's already gone. So I do have to update the site because there are several pieces that are already gone, um, but it's drank, there. Drank it I think there's some next to the fridge. Oh, look at that. There's some next to the fridge. Thank you. Um, okay, so we have the preset pieces. The we have um, a Mother's Day section just to make it a little bit easier for you guys. We have Easter um, pieces up, but I don't have them separated. So if you're looking for um, those, you might be able to find some of those in the um mother's day section also we have like seven or eight new pieces up so i'll have jay show those once he gets back in um but we have our wildflowers which has been crazy popular uh since we brought it in just last week so wildflowers is a sterling silver cage pendant it's almost egg shaped um let me see if i have it sitting here it fits two pearls it fits two pearls and i don't know if you can be able to see that um, sterling silver cage and a cage pendant simply means thanks babe. if you've never seen our jewelry before a cage pendant simply means that you are opening it up maybe you're opening it up like that you're putting your pearls inside you close it and then it locks in place with the chain so I'm gonna have Jay show that close Karen says, I can't even get the hubby to visit, let alone move there. Oh, for Hawaii? Oh, Alaska. Ooh. Oh, Robin got hers. Do you love it, Robin? So we have this piece. This is brand new. This is adorable, by the way, for Easter. This is our, oh, you need a, I have it. I need a lot of things. <laughs> this is our cotton tail. But Jay has just sat down, so. That's a great gift for your mother-in-law for Easter. They're waiting for you to hold it up to, for them. Oh, pretend to know. <laughs> we there's, for, only, there's only one of me. All right, so he's going to show you their cottontail here, our brand new diamond, yeah. but I can't, I don't think I named it that. You need two of me. I might have. The diamond cage, the wildflowers. Well, three of me. Oh my gosh, three of you. Can you even imagine that? We have our new autism awareness and we have one of our new joyful hearts as well. So seven new pieces. I think everybody needs a J. Everybody does need a J in their life. Okay, let me take one of these off. So you'll see the, the difference between a um, drilled setting and a cage pendant. So the drilled setting. Is this the duplicate? That's a duplicate, yeah. This is the so this is a cage pendant. So that one is the one that opens and this one is a drilled setting here. All right, and then I have two more after that. Hold up, what's going on here? Mr. Bunny got stuck on my finger. There we go. Angela, I got your order. Wednesday. All right, so the next thing we're going to do, I'm going to just have him show you two more pieces, and then we're going to go ahead and get started on the first oyster of the night. First oyster of the night is going to someone who commented on any of our posts during the week on Facebook. Don't forget, we are on Instagram, at Jersey Girl Pearls. We're on Pinterest, Jersey Girl Pearls. We are on YouTube, Jersey Girl Pearls. The world can't handle one of me. Oh, hi, Angela. I see you there. All righty. The uh, hashtag tonight is pearls, guys. Like and share pearls. When we get up to 30 live views, we will give away a free oyster to someone who has shared and used the hashtag pearls. Jay, sorry, one more thing. You know that thing I asked you to cut up? Yeah. Can, do you have any of them cut? Do I have anything cut? Are you kidding me? You were just waiting for Unbelievable. Me to Oh, they're ginormous, so I have to, you have to actually cut so it fits in the, on the top and the bottom. It has to be the perfect, 
<laughs> he hates me. He hates me right now. All right, let's do the first oyster of the night. First oyster of the night is going to someone who commented on one of our posts. We had a lot of comments this week. Make sure you cut it perfectly straight. No, not perfectly straight. Just so that it's... Sorry. Oh, my God. Alright, are we ready? Gotta get a paper cutter. Is this one? Faith Max. Faith Max is the winner today. Congratulations, Faith. I do not see, think I've seen Faith on. She is a new customer. Or new in general, I should say. But she commented on our post. So, Faith, are you here? If Faith is not here, I need to know am I pulling a bright or a classic from her? A little crooked now. Thanks, babe. I'm dropping hints for someone to buy me my stories. Not oh yeah, that one's a beautiful one. My story isn't over yet, right? Okay. We'll wait one second to see if Faith is on. If Faith is not on, then we need to decide: are we pulling a bright or a classic for her? Right. So. Oh, make it a mess. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We have so many pieces of jewelry, guys, to choose from. What am I getting for Mother's Day? You want something for Mother's Day? My two front teeth. But that's Christmas. That is Christmas. Alright, I don't see it sitting out here. But I'm sure I'll come across it and then I'll hold it up when I come across it. Though my story isn't over yet. It's a sterling silver charm necklace. It's beautiful. It has a semicolon on one side. And the phrase... Oh, here we go. My story isn't over yet. Jay will show you. Thank you, my love. Let me just put these sharp scissors Yeah, it can down. mean anything to anyone. Absolutely. All right. Here we go. Ready for the hair model? There he is. There he is, he says. All right, everybody says bright. We're gonna, here's my bright bowl tonight. You, sh you showed front and back, my love? I know you did, I don't even have to. No, I just, I have I to just, have. I just showed the sides. Oh I my didn't. gosh, okay, where should I take from in here? Should I dig in deep? All right, I'm gonna try to wear two gloves. I, my nails just got done for vacation. We leave for vacation this week. I am going to probably put on two pairs of gloves. Yes, anybody could rock that piece. Okay, so um, what was I going to say? I'll have to take a look in a little while. It's Jay Bird's behind the camera doing all this little action back here. But thank you for sending me the pics. All right, Karen, are you on? If Karen is on, she's going to be the first one. Today she's gonna get a board pick. Yeah, Jen, I keep I'm gonna rock that piece. I keep meaning to to, to, to grab one for myself. Alright, and we're gonna time stamp right now 38 13, which just means that I literally spoke for 38 minutes. Isn't that funny? <laughs> Alright, so all Faith had to do was comment on a post on our page. We are doing a cruise actually we are we are so we're doing Where are we're we leaving going? from new york so we're gonna do bermuda bahamas right what are you Florida. singing that song from uh beach boys beach boys <laughs> we are looking at twins oh my goodness look at how beautiful these twins are oh my goodness so those are like seafoam green twins Amazing. I love, love, love to start out the show with twins. <laughs> Almost lost them. Yay. Oh my gosh. And they are so pretty. Thanks, Kim. What did I do? I missed it. Oh my word. Let's get them measured. I'm going to say 7.2. They're not that big. 6.9. Not even close. Yeah, it's close. It's, not, it's a pretty good guess. Oh, crap. Stop it. No. Sorry. Work. 
and 6.8. So these are very close for earrings. And the coat, these, these are probably one of the most, like one of the prettiest twins we've ever got. And maybe it's because I really love this color, but they're like a sea foam green. So one 6.9, one 6.8, you'll see one's just a little bit deeper. It's amazing. Take a look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. So actually, let me put it on her name thing. So at 38.13, today is 4.13. And we got twins. And this is first oyster. First O-O-N I did. Look at how beautiful those are. See, one is just a little bit deeper than the other one absolutely beautiful give her a thumbs up and a love guys and she's not even on i'll have to put her name up on the the site don't let me forget faith max absolutely stunning oh my gosh i love them they are so so pretty oh beautiful good for a frog cage okay i'm writing that down because i did not write that down last time and i know you asked for that so I'm writing myself a note to find a frog cage. Right. Find the frog cage, Jen. Um, also guys, if you see, I have two of the um, elastic bracelets on. So this is the blush and this is the darker pearled one, dark pearls. And then here is the one that actually has a sterling silver clasp. This one we called the coastline, I think. Um, beautiful, beautiful dark um, pearls. These are Baroque. Um, all of them are Baroque shaped. They're freshwater, so they have different shapes on them, um, or to them, I should say. They have beautiful undertone colors on them. So there's greens and blues and purples coming through. These are on the site as well. Great for Mother's Day. Um, great for Easter. But I wanted you to know that they are there. Be good for a Tinkerbell cage. I will do that. I will write that as well. We do have a, um, do you want, so you don't want like a fairy. You want like the actual Tinkerbell. Is that what you want? Um, the, we do have a fairy, um, uh, drilled setting. So the fairy sits upon the pearl. It's really, really pretty. So that we have that in the drilled setting for sterling silver, but I will look for a Tinkerbell cage and then let me know um oh yeah i guess you do mean the actual tinkerbell because that's a good color yeah it's beautiful we have so i think that might be one of our newer colors that sea foam we haven't seen that for a long long time in fact i feel like the sea foams um were from the other farm that we used to use because if you remember we saw a lot of sea foams in the very beginning when we first got colors and then we did it we saw like our sage greens and our dark greens um but not so much seafoam like that was like a true true seafoam it was hey nancy how you doing welcome hi guys What's hi the... nancy yes go ahead post your questions here all right so karen Nicolas, you are up um karen ordered the preset so if she's not here we're just gonna hold off then for her to do her board pick and then priscilla you will be up priscilla are you here and we're gonna do two brights for priscilla um, and we're going to do a board pick for her as well. So remember, every $65 gets you a board pick. Every $150 gets you a board pick and a wheel spin. So Priscilla, are you here? We're going to do a board pick for Priscilla. And we're going to do um, brights. So hey, Priscilla. One, two, three, four, and five so the way it works is if you order less than five oysters i will give you a lineup of five and let you choose which ones are yours if it's more than five we'll just grab them for you priscilla is here okay priscilla you get a board pick my dear in honor of spring we have blossoms and bunnies all right so two questions so uh with the drilled setting how do you handle that with the pearl Okay, so Diane, so the drilled setting, how do you handle that with the pearl? Okay, so I'm not quite sure the question. So we have the two settings. We have the cage pendants where we just put the pearls inside. Hey, Carla, how you doing? And you can interchange doing? them. 
but the drilled setting so like I'm wearing I'm in love with the Luna I'm wearing the Luna right now so this is a drilled setting so we, we drill the pearl physically and set it in here set it so it should never come appropriately. out appropriately um it is set so if you have a cage you can interchange them but if you have a, a drilled setting you cannot interchange them they're on there for good so Nancy if you order the playful pup it does not come with a pearl so the way it works is that we have all of our oysters are 25 a piece the more oysters the um, that you purchase the less they are per oyster when you purchase any jewelry it gives you an option to add pearls on so that's the fun stuff so if you order any kind of jewelry so if you order the playful pup then it'll say you can buy one um, oyster for $19.99 or two for $35. So you really get a good deal if you do the two. Um, but you can also add on one for less than you would be able to if you just bought the oyster alone. Does that make sense? Hi, Carla from New Hampshire. She wants bunny number four. So does that mean I have to send my pro back to you to have it drilled? Yes, the pearl. Yes. So if you, so that's why a lot of times if you aren't aren't sure yeah so the short answer is yes so you would just send your pearl that you want drilled back to me and that's it we'll get it and then we'll set it in the piece that you order that's the short answer yeah um sometimes if you are if you have a couple pearls and you're like you know i think i'm gonna buy jewelry we'll hold your pearls so you can say hey jen like so if you had bought pearls today and you were like i'm not sure the jewelry i want can you just hold those pearls like we'll open them but I can hold them for you. And you can say, just hold them for me until I figure out what piece of jewelry I want. And that way you don't have to um, send anything back to us. But because you you didn't know that, that's fine. You just send them back. People send back pearls all of the time. Because also when people order earrings, it's hard to get that perfect match. So sometimes it takes a few times and then they send them back. So yes, that's exactly how it would go. The only thing I will say is we one time had someone Put the pearl in like an envelope rather than um, like wrapping it at all. Like you could even wrap it in tissue and it would be fine. But someone had put it in like an actual envelope. So when we got the envelope, there was like a hole in the side of the envelope. Maybe the machine had just like, as it went through, just swiped it right on out. It was literally loose. So we just say, make sure to put it in. It doesn't have to be a bubble wrap, but just wrap it in something. Okay. I'm going back to bunny number four. Bunny number four. Sorry about that, Priscilla. Hi, Amy. Jan is giving you some um, um, some skillets. Is everything okay at work? No, I'm just having an issue. Number four, you get a wheel spin. Holy moly, Priscilla. That was a pretty darn good pick. All right, so let me try to turn this a little. So she gets a wheel spin. So wheel spins normally are for 150 or more. That's what she got on our board, guys. So let's see what we get. You are gonna play Secrets in the Sand. Holy moly. All right, so your board pick gave you a wheel spin, which gave you Secrets in the Sand. Oh my gosh, okay. So Jay's not in here, so we'll do your oysters first, and then we will play Secrets in the Sand. If you guys have never seen Secrets in the Sand, it's the only game that we offer here. You can actually um, purchase the game to play on our site, jerseygirlpearls.com. Up at the top, you would pick games, and then we could play it here. Um, but you could also win it as well. So here we go. So I'm going to do your oysters first to get your two. I got your little note here about the earrings, which is great. So we're gonna do the two and then we'll do secrets in the sand. And if you've never seen it, you guys will love it. And also guys, make sure to share our video, use the hashtag pearls. All right, number one has a bunch of sea worms here on the back and it's actually quite heavy. Number two is a little guy, a little bit of grass there on the bottom. Number three has some pretty red shell right in the middle. I'm hoping you guys can see this. I have a delay, so I can't tell if you can see it yet. And my camera is kind of far from me today. This looks almost completely clean. Just a little bit of grass there at the top. And here's our dark and stormy one of the group. Tons of grass, even some sea worms up there. And it kind of has a thick middle. All right, so Priscilla, here we go. 
One, two, three, four, and five, and you get to choose two. So these are braids. Which two would you like? Guys, orders are wide open, jerseygirlpearls.com. You can order oysters there and we'll open them live. Five and four, all righty. Here we go, what colors are you hoping for? Jay's getting work calls right now, that's what he's doing. His phone kept going off because the hospital was messaging him. All right, let's see what we get. Hopefully something quick and easy he can take care of. Wow, let's see what that is. That one's beautiful. I wanna say purple. It's so funny, my first reaction was like a silver, but it looks more like that very beautiful light lilac-y color. So guys, we have two collections. We have a bright collection and we have a natural um, classic collection. And the bright collection are dyed pearls, like the ones you're seeing now. A beautiful copper, my goodness. Beautiful copper. Bronze, maybe almost like a bronze, like a penny almost. Copper penny. So our bright collections have beautifully dyed pearls in them and our natural or classic collection um, has like your whites and ivories and creams and natural pinks, the colors that are not dyed at all. All right, so here is one of our, so we have like this newer color that is almost like a whisper of a purple. It's so pretty. So that one is this color, 7.4 it's saying. Like a whisper of a, like a lilac color different than our natural. And here's your copper 7.2, copper penny. Absolutely beautiful. Jay, are you around? Yes, sir. That's okay, I just need you to hold up. You're going to love them. This one still has some oyster on it. I'm here, I'm back, sorry. He's here. All right, so your copper your copper actually has like, I'm going to show you. It's missing a little bit of like color in the nacre. So I'll let you choose. It's not, it doesn't want to sit on that point. I'll let you choose if you're okay that it has a little bit of a nacre mishap. Because some people don't mind. A little bit of character oh my god it's so funny every single time I go to put it down it doesn't show it okay hold on so you can let me know if I'm pulling another one instead of the copper so we don't exchange colors like if you don't like your color um, or something like that we don't actually ever have that problem but um, if there's like a nacre issue I'll give you an option because I don't want you to have one that you that has like a imperfection in the actual maker. Okay, so I have it upright. I feel like that light lilac-y one is almost turning like a light blue. Let's see what it looks like in there. So Priscilla, let me know. Um, there's a little bit of a imperfection in the maker. So let me know if you would like me to pull another one or if you are okay with that copper penny. Sorry, Jana. I'll try to come up with Bermuda, another song. Bahama. Come on, pretty mamas. Can you even see it? <laughs> I don't know if you can see it now that I'm looking at it. I can see it. So doesn't that, now that looks like an icy blue, right? Pull other. Okay, so I when I first pulled this, I thought that was our light lilac, but now it looks like icy blue, right? Like an icy blue color. I think it's an icy blue. Man, did that change. Okay, I'm pulling, I'm grabbing another. So don't, you guys, when things like that happen, we recognize that you guys are paying, you know, you guys are paying good money for these and we are not going to give you something um, that is, that I feel like doesn't meet our, um, our standards, I guess I should say. Um, 
all pearls have imperfections. They're not perfect or else they would be beads. Um, they could have little dimples in them. That just gives them character. But when I feel like there's something in the actual nature of the pearl, um, I will always give you the option. She says, I love, I, well, you know, it's so funny. It's fooling me. And I'm wondering if it's because um, I have the cup over here. This one's really tightly closed. So every single order um, for the last couple shows and through May, guys, um, every single order gets an entry into our um, Easter giveaway. It's not really Easter. It's our spring giveaway because we're gone during Easter. Um, and that is one of our mugs, <laughs> which are amazing. Our tumblers, I should say. But the tumbler, I'll show you the color. I'm wondering if that was playing off of that, and that's why I thought it was. Um, um, the light lilac rather than that icy blue. All right, I don't feel twins in here, and this is a beautiful purple. Just do one more time. Sometimes, oh, it could be a little tricky. Beautiful purple, deep purple. All right, so this one is a 6.6. .6. And I'm going to remove the copper. Put that down there. You can use that for jewelry. Okay. Let me put these on an even playing field. Jay, are you around? Yeah. So here is the mug that, or the tumbler I was talking about. This is the one that can be won. This is our spring giveaway. It's got a necklace inside. You're going to get five oysters with it. Any order between now and May, probably the middle of May, um, gets an entry into this. And if you pre-order, like Priscilla did, she gets 10 extra entries. And I think there's 10 extra entries on the board, too. So ocean shells, mermaid spells, Jersey Girl pearls. It's amazing. But anyway, so here's the lilac, and it was sitting right next to it. So I feel like maybe it was playing off of that because I'm usually pretty good with naming those colors and i wonder if it's going to look more lilac now that it's next to a purple let's take yeah. a look trust me jen i wish i wasn't a fridge, right in now. The fridge is everything taken care of at work no 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 you have to go in that's the question no okay so then i'm okay with that. i have to be a referee oh no all right so i can't see it yet because i have a delay no, it still looks like the icy blue. Ice, ice, baby. Woo, too cold, too cold. Look, I have no r r rights to that song at all or, or anything. <laughs> Why are you stuttering? <laughs> oh my God, he's so cute. Okay, beautiful, beautiful Priscilla. Absolutely lovely, congratulations. And thank you so much for your order. They are beautiful. have that song stuck in her head. Yeah, don't get that in our head. Hi, Michelle, how are you? So I'm re the current book that I'm reading is... Michelle, good day, mate. Um, oh, that's oh. the wrong country, sorry. Yeah, totally wrong. What, what book am I reading? Oh, Eleanor Oliphant. 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 But she's like Scotland, I think. That's where they are. Did, has anybody ever read, uh, read this book? No. Eleanor Oliphant. Jan, do you want to switch right now? Because I love it, by the way. I'd rather be sick than be dealing with these issues. But. All right, Priscilla, we got those in. Oh, we're going to do Secrets in the Sand for Priscilla. That's what she won on the wheel spin. So Priscilla uh, spent at least $65. I hopped 65. on just in time for she a little ice, pick. ice baby from Jay. Her board <laughs> pick got a wheel spin, and the wheel spin gave us Secrets in the Sand. So Jay is going to give me Secrets in the Sand. If you have never seen this before, hang on Wow, Jay's, to your knickers. <laughs> Jay's doing multiple things right now. All right, so Secrets in the Sand, guys. So this is the only game that we have on our entire website. Oh, so if you head over to jerseygirlpearls.com because you want to play this, up at the top it says Games. There's a drop-down, and there's one game available to purchase, and it's this. This is Secrets in the Sand. So there are pearls in every single one of these. Um, in one of them, there are twins. So this is how it works. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Priscilla gets to choose a number. We will see um, which pearl or pearl she gets and then she gets to choose whether she keeps it or cans it sound good all right priscilla this is your winning game tonight one two three four five or six which number would you like mary popped on just to hear ice ice baby we want to hear it again right mary poppins four all right let's see what we get and oh, she's gonna tell us my whether assistant we are has finally returned 
Ooh, wow, look at that color. Amazing, like, turquoise color. Wow. How's L.A., Jess? Hi, hang, Jess, hang, how are you? Hanging with the stars, going to, oh. going to pump. And what's the other one now? Tom Tom. What? Sir and Tom Tom. All right, 6.6. .6, beautiful, beautiful Caribbean blue. Take a peek at that. And then, Priscilla, you have to tell us, are you keeping it or canning it? So the caveat of this game is you actually get a second choice if you don't want the first one. But whatever the second one is, is the one that you're left with. It's great. Beautiful day. Picking out fixtures. Getting the bathroom so right Priscilla, done. So Priscilla, let me know. Keep it or can it? Sorry for interrupting, Jay. I know. It's a story. About, I'm just going to walk away now, guys. Stop. Nice oh knowing you. That just means he wants attention, talk to you, ladies. Talk to you Let's next, give him a talk, thumbs up and a love. Talk to you next week. Okay, so the, I'm just telling you, the camera does not show you how beautiful this is. I She wants to can it. Uh, but Michelle. before we can it, I need to put it on the, the white salt because um, I just saw what it looked like. I'm borderline rowing right now. Borderline rowing. With me? I just have to show it a little bit. She said can it number six. Okay. I'm hoping that one shows it a little bit better because that color is amazing. All right. Just going to go use the loo real quick. You can't. I can't use no, the loo? you have to wait. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Michelle, All right. she won't let me use the loo. Here we go. <gasps> wow. How about a deep blue? Union break. Not yet. A gorgeous deep blue. 6.9. Is that my hair? Take a look at that. Absolutely stunning. I can literally see my reflection. Can you, can you guys see me in this? Because <laughs> I can it, see me in the reflection. Is it so shiny? You see a little dot right there? That's me. That is so funny. I have to replace That's it. outrageous, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Oh, my gosh. Oh, yeah, you are in there. I'm gonna have to go <laughs> you should have waved. I'm going to go have to tell my mom that you're not letting me use the loo. Oh, my gosh. Okay, can you just... Oh, my God. Just show it on there, I, too, because it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Priscilla, I hope you love it. It's beautiful. I have to replace it. And then Jay has to shuffle. So that is how we play Secrets in the Sand. It's not too bad, right? Okay, there you go. I'm so glad that you love it. It is beautiful, like stunningly beautiful. All right. So you're hearing Jay just shuffle them around for the next game. Beautiful, Priscilla. Ah, oh, crap. Alrighty. So Karen Cullis, if you are here. Bye, guys. <laughs> Union break. Um, Karen Cullis, if you are here, we have a board. We have to do a board pick for you. All right, Priscilla, thank you so much. So you're getting an entry into um, the Easter giveaway or the spring giveaway. You're getting 10, actually. You're getting 11. <clears throat> so let me put that on there. And then we have to have five orders in order to um, get Mystery Hostess tonight. So Mystery Hostess tonight is $50 gift card to our store. So if we have at least five orders, that will trigger that, and you'll get um, a $50. You'll go into the drawing for a $50 gift card at the end of our show. So we're going to... Um, I'm going to put a note here so that if we get that, um, that you'll go into it. So every, the way Mystery Hostess works is that every oyster that you order gets you an entry into Mystery Hostess. All right. Thank you, Priscilla. Thank you for your order. And I'm so glad that you love it. All right. If Karen Cullis is not on yet, we have Angela. Angela, you are up, girlfriend. All righty. So we are doing... one board pick and one wheel spin. So guys, um, also the $65 and the 150 is always after, di before, sh uh, before tax and shipping, we pretty much take care of tax. So before shipping and after discount code. So um, if you are using any 
um, coupon codes at all, which is fine. Um, we still let you um, participate in the boards and the wheels. It's just after the coupon has um, cleared. All right, Angela's here. So we're doing one board pick and one wheel spin for you, my dear. So guys, orders are wide open. I have no more orders right now after Angela. So if you head over to jerseygirlpearls.com, you can put in orders there and we will open your oysters live. All right, here we go. Should I do this first? Can we see it? We are doing secrets in the sand, yay! Okay, so we are doing another secrets in the sand tonight. And now you get a board pick as well. So we have bunnies and blossoms. One sec, I'm sorry. You're fine. I just realized even when I moved this over, there's like a glare. I might have screwed that up, I don't know. It didn't move over as nicely as I thought it was going to. So we have bunnies and blossoms. So guys, we would love if you shared our video. If you do use the hashtag pearls when we get up to 30 live views, we will give away a free oyster. Can you share in those? Can you share again? Oh, that's what I meant to do. Thank you. Somebody's yelling at me on my phone. <laughs> Thanks, my love. Blossoms number five. Blossoms number five. Besides secrets in the sand, you are also getting $15 in Jersey Girl Pearl cash. That is a coupon code that will come over to you. The way that works is our coupon codes never expire. So if you get a coupon code from us, you can use it whenever you would like to. Um, all right, Jersey Girl Pearl Cash. Congratulations. So you got a $15 gift card from us. Plus you were playing Secrets in the Sand after we open your oysters. Now I have 15 classics. Are we doing all classics or are we splitting those? And we're also going into our spring giveaway. And I have to check your loyalty card to see how close we are for you. Thanks for sharing, guys. So, guys, if you're just tuning in, I'm Jen. My husband, Jay, is behind the camera, and we own Jersey Girl Pearls. We open oysters to reveal beautiful pearls. We have wonderful jewelry to go with it. So if you check out jerseygirlpearls.com, you can actually order right now, and we will open your oysters live. Um, Jay and I actually work in medicine. We work um, in a hospital Monday through Friday, and we do pearls at night and on the weekends. So everything that you guys order goes straight from us to you. All classics. Okay. <laughs> My goodness, I hope I have that many in here. I think I do. Let's see. And if I can drive to Hawaii, I would drive it all the way to Jana, Ten, personally. Three, four, five, With some chicken six, soup. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh my goodness. Eleven, twelve. Mary, you still there? 13, you still alive? 14, 15. Oh my goodness, so did we I lose you? I didn't like stock the, um, so sometimes I re like restock, but I didn't restock the classic, but I just enough. I have a couple, left. I have plenty. I just have to, would have to get them. I'm so glad that I have enough. <laughs> All right. So we are going to open 15 classics. Wish I was eating Holy on my moly. patio dinner right now. Holy moly. Okay. Actually, let me just move this over for one second and I'll put a new towel down. So I'm on an even playing field. So guys, tell me what your weekend plans are. Anything good? Does anybody want to come over and help me redo paint the bathroom? and redo a bathroom and design and all that good stuff? We didn't realize how much went into like designing a bathroom. I have a bathtub sitting in the back of my truck right now. Hi, Deb Duffy. She's watching from her patio having some dinner. That sounds amazing. What is the weather like in Arizona, Deb? Uh, I'm going to say it's 30 degrees and snowing. In Arizona. Do we have any Tennessee people on? Anybody from Tennessee on? House cleaning, yuck. Oh my god, this. Mary, where are you? Mary, oh god. Mary, got her in the face. Oh my god. You are taking a shower before you come to bed tonight, young lady. Don't even come near me. Oh my god. Mary, where are you? Did you see that? Well, a little seafood. Oh my god! I feel. I'm for. Oh, awesome! You got to tell us all about I, it, Becky. I feel. <laughs> We're interested. Oh my god! We're moving. I just. Oh. Can you give me like a wet paper towel, but not like soaking, like just 
enough for it. Literally, guys, I'm, I don't think it got in my mouth. I think I would know. I'm gonna give you a my though. whole face was just splashed. I don't think it went in my eye, but oh my God. Oh my Lord, it went everywhere, all over my face. All right, good times, guys, good times. I have God only knows from the China Sea now all over my. There you go. Thanks, thanks so much. I just feel like I need to. Did you see it, Mary? Did you record oh. it? Got to replay oh it. God. Post it on Twitter. Oh my lord! All right, good times. It's awesome. Don't worry, Becky. I need a moist. <laughs> I'm gonna make sure that she takes a shower before she comes near me tonight. Oh. Did you think I was coming near you today? <laughs> I guess not. Wow. <laughs> I guess, uh... Oh, my God. That was awful. Okay. I, it could be worse. I don't think it got in my mouth. I think we're good. Sunny and 78 in Arizona. So nice. Oh, my goodness, guys. So, we are opening all classics for Angela today. This is so exciting. We don't get to open as many classics. So, if you have been with us a long time... We started with just having classics. Okay, this one is really, really juicy, so let me make sure that I'm doing it like away from my face. She needs a scrub brush, Mary. Um, so we started out with only doing classics, like back in 2017. And then we worked, um, our farm got, ended up getting dyed ones, um, or did the process of dyeing them. So we ended up getting those from them. Um, and sent, we have since, pretty much mostly changed over to another farm but we do use both um and now we have all different colors but there was a time when only the classics were offered and they are beautiful and we that's why we separate them still because we have a um a divide between you know people that want really really bright beautiful dyed colors versus those beautiful natural ones that are not dyed so we are going to see, there's less variety in the classics. That's the only thing. Brillo pad is really actually accurate. Okay. I got one of those too. You want it? Oh my Lord. If I come, if, I, if next week I have something growing on my face. Oh my then I'm Lord. going on vacation by myself. Ugh. This is Stunning. Oh my gosh, this is a gorgeous one. If I want to take a cruise. Holy This is a beautiful pink. Oh my gosh, is this beautiful. So this is what I'm gonna actually put it on the salt because I want to show you with like what a true natural pink looks you like. You know what that would look good in? 7.2. That would look great in that right there, that piece right there. Yep. <laughs> just saying. That's our love not pendant in sterling silver, but just take a peek. Oh my gosh. So that's a natural pink. Through and through, absolutely stunning. So compared to like, I hope that did not get in my eyeball. Compared to like the like cotton candy pinks and the fuchsia pinks, that is just a really good representation of what a natural pink looks like. It's so, so pretty. And the luster is so high on it. So guys, you can put in orders, jerseygirlpearls.com, and we will open your oysters live. Put them in. Uh, this one is stuck in there. A beautiful ivory. Great Easter gift. No twin in there. Beautiful ivory. Mom's Day is coming up. That one would also look good in the love knot. She says, Becky says, I love my love knot necklace and earrings. Yes, that is, I want to say, customer top rated. Um, we have these love knot earrings that we have had since the beginning. And now we added the pendant that Jay just showed a second ago. Um, that is a beautiful ivory as well. Um, we added the pendant and it is just as beautiful as the earrings. Um, so I can have Jay show that one again. Let me rinse this one. I think this is a champagne. Yes, a beautiful champagne. So we are opening from our classic collection, different than those bright, bright colors. These ones are natural um, classics. So what happens is we do have a dyed black in both collections. And we do that because the black is very popular by all. So we have it in both. This one is very meaty. Whew, that is jumping back in there. This one looks like a light pink. 
Yes, it looks like it. It looks like it's a soft, like whisper pink, um, with maybe a touch, a touch of ivory on it. Now the pearls are whispering to each other. Whisper. Well, like that one before, I really thought it was a whisper of like lilac, and it ended up being like an icy blue. There's a whisper of Jay behind the camera. There sure is. How about a beautiful white one? I have to kind of dig, guys. The reason I wear gloves is because I dig to, to see if there are twins in there. So we will show these all up close. We'll get them measured and show them up close in just a minute. I'm trying to determine whether that stuff got in my eye. I don't think it did. I think I would have noticed. Literally got everywhere else, though. A beautiful pink that has apricot on it. Stunning. It makes... Well, your so eyelashes it, got really long all of a sudden. Oh, because they're growing now because of some weird... Great. <laughs> if anything starts to grow out of my face, just let me know. You got I'll a whisper still, of oysters? I'll still, I'll, still <laughs> sure take, I'll still take you on the cruise with me. Aww. Mary said I got a whisper of <laughs> oyster juice on me. Hmm. Oh my gosh, where's the eye wash station? <laughs> That's what I want to know. Well, we'll have to get one. Deb loves her love knot earrings. Now she needs the pendant. The pendant is stunning. Absolutely stunning. It's Jay's favorite one to hold up. We have a beautiful white one. So we have a soft pink, we have champagne, we have ivory, we have white, we have a natural pink there, no twin in that one. Where are the twins? Let's give her some love. Thumbs up and love. Let's get some twins in here. And guys, orders are wide open, so jerseygirlpearls.com. And we will open your oysters live. I'm gonna sit. Oh, we are twins. Five. Beautiful twins. And it's funny, they are different shapes and different hues. Can we see that? It's like a soft pink and almost like a white with it. I'm gonna put those off to the side. Let me rinse them. I'm probably a little too far. I'm just seeing myself hold it up because I have a delay. Um, it might be a little bit too far for you to actually see that. This is a beautiful light one. I know, can you imagine? Oh my lord. It's so gross. It can't be as worse as the time that it shot into my eyeball. Like shot into my eyeball. Mary missed that one. We still talk about that one, but it literally shot in my eye. I had to like jump up and go and like rinse my eyeball. I think I had like makeup coming down my face. <laughs> I didn't care. I was like, oh my gosh. Hi, Dorota. How are you? Thanks for joining us. Hey, Dorota. How about a beautiful dark one? Stunning. No twin in this one. Beautiful black. Where's all my peeps? Guys, don't forget, we give away an oyster at the end of every show. The only thing you have to do is give this video a thumbs up and tell us where you're watching from. And you can be vague. You can be the winner. You can be the winner. We're looking at another natural pink. No one actually still has oyster stuck on it. Angela, were there colors that you were particularly hoping for? I know we're gonna try to match up earrings, right? I think you got a fair amount of classics last time too. We are looking at another dark one. So hopefully between the two of these at least we'll be able to find some good matches. Beautiful dark one. That dark one has a lot of purple on it. Hi, Ariana from Vermont. How are you? Thanks for joining us. Give Ariana a thumbs up, guys. Say hi to her. We are looking at a beautiful ivory. 
You're watching us and the Yanks. We could have went to the game. <laughs> we could have gone to the game today. It's funny that you say that. My, Did we win? My neighbor was giving tickets so I Um But I said we can't go, we have a show. Robin is from Michigan. She said, no, I'm just having a hard time deciding on which color to go with on the knot sets. Angela, I gotcha. Take, take your time. I gotcha. No rush. All right, here we go. So the love knots are easy in the sense that anything looks good in them. So um, for myself, I've set white ones and lavender ones um, for myself. I've set... I don't, I can honestly say I don't set a lot of brights in the love knots. Typically the more classic ones go in there and that's just people's preference. But I get what you mean. But they do, I mean, it looks really beautiful with any, any classic color. I know that you're leaning towards classic and it really would look nice with any. I've said, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I've said blues uh, with the love knots. So th that first one is so beautiful. Um, so when I call, oh, it's going to measure it. When I called that first one a true pink, leave it to me to get a true pink after that one. 7.1. So we're going to look at the difference here. So we're going to say this pink, the pink with the like apricot color. Actually, I think that second one is just a pure one. 7.0. Okay. Jay, hold these up really quick. So you know how I said this very first one was a true pink? This is actually a lavender. Make me eat my words here because I got two natural pinks after that. Take a look at those two. And then we're going to measure all these light ones. Yay, Yankees are winning ninth inning. I don't know, but my neighbor was very upset uh, earlier <laughs> about the Yanks. And... Thanks, Jana and Karen. <laughs> I don't need any more character. <laughs> so can we see that? Can we see that's the natural pinks? Those ones have a nice dose of like an apricot color on them. So then that first one really turns out to be more of like a lavender gold. I'm still looking at it because I have a delay. Um, but really, really pretty. Okay, so let's look at the, the lighter ones. You have 6.9. This one is more of a white 7.1. We're gonna line them up next to each other here. 7.1, really, really pretty colors. Pretty. 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 7.2. So that last one in the second row has a touch of blush on it. It's really pretty. This one does too, 7.0, has just a touch of pink on it and you'll see it. Sometimes it's hard to tell until you get it on that white self just to see how many colors are actually on these beautiful pearls. So 7.1 for that ivory. It has a huge piece of oyster on it. So give me one second. Totally thought I got that off of there. So, so pretty. I think there's still oyster on it, but I will get that off before we send that to you. 6.7. Wait until you guys see how pretty these are. We have a I'm little doing one some here. homework here. 6.1. So. Is Michelle still on? I just want to let her know that I am chuffed. 7.3. About all these pearls. 7.3 for the black one. 7.2 for the dark one that has purple on it. I'm going to put those on the dark salt for you. And then your twins, I'll put it at the very top, 6.9. And that one has like a pink hue. Then you have a little one, a 6.2 next to it, and that one's more ivory. Okay. So we're going to, they're so pretty. There's an ugly piece of oyster right there, but I'm not going to ruin the whole batch. So we have this like lavender gold. Then we have these two natural pinks that really have a, a nice bit of apricot color on them. Then we have these ivories and some, some more of like whiter ones in here. And then you'll see these ones on the side here are ivory with a touch of like a blush color. It's so, so pretty. So take a peek. Jan, I'm going to wear my wife beater and all my uh, oh gold God. chains. Don't encourage him, Jana. Oh, my goodness. Can you imagine? Hi, Andrea. Going to do a Guido style. Say hi to my sister, guys. Andrea just popped on. Give her a thumbs up and a love. She did invite us over for a barbecue tonight, but we said we can't go. We, uh, we some, have a show. Miss some good burgers. 
I was, I'm just bummed we missed out on the s'mores. <laughs> Aren't those beautiful? So I'm looking at them now up there. So the ones, this one in here actually looks like it, the one with the, with the pearl, the oyster stuck to it looks like it has a bit of like a, um, a soft pink on it. It's really, really pretty. They are beautiful, Angela. Okay, before I forget, so then we did 15 classics for Angela. We did, her board pick was at $15, Dollars a Girl Pro Cash, and now we're doing Secrets in the Sand. Angela is a wizard at this game. Did I mix Can, oh, you did mix, yes, you didn't, well, you didn't show the dark ones. Did you show the dark ones? I did not, give me one second. He's coming. I'm coming back to you. They are so pretty. Really, really beautiful. Classics. I need, I need another set of hands. And the Yankees won, yay! Thumbs up, guys. Can I do a thumbs up on here? I probably can. I don't see the bottom of the thing though. I see nothing. Okay, so I don't see the dark yet. I don't even actually see him holding anything yet. Um, Andrea, you missed, I opened an oyster and it squirted all over my face. Okay, so the one on the left is like a pure black, although the one on the right of it has a purple on it. And I feel like it's ricocheting off the other one because I see more purple on this one. But maybe they do both have a touch of purple on them. Absolutely beautiful. 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 Oh, you're so welcome. Okay, so we're not going to uh, forget. <laughs> I was about to say we're not going to remember. We're not going to forget. Uh, forget that you just won Secrets in the Sand. So we're going to play that right now to add to your beautiful pearls. Jaden, take the cue. <laughs> and we're going to play Secrets in the Sand. <laughs> All right. So guys, our only game on our entire site is called Secrets in the Sand. There are pearls in every single one of these. One of them has twins. When you play this game, you get two choices. We'll do your first one. We'll show you what the pearl looks like, pearl or pearls. Um, you decide if you want to can it or keep it, and then you get to choose another one if you want. Um, the only caveat is if you choose the second one, like if you choose not to take the first one, um, you are left with whatever you get on the second one. All right, so here we go, Angela. We have one, two, three, four, five, and six. What number are we going with? Seven. So we did play this game already, and uh, Priscilla got a gorgeous, gorgeous Pepsi can blue. I even feel like it was deeper blue than that. Number four. Four. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four. Here we go. Oh, and if I didn't mention before, one of them has twins. All right, so I don't see twins in this one. I see a beautiful, very pretty lavender one. It's like, actually, it might be more of a rose gold. I want to put it next to your lavender, actually. Okay, 7.0. Let me, I'm going to show it to you in your group. I'm going to put it right here. So you can see what that looks like. It's this one right here on the end. Oh, you're lucky I was watching where you put it. It's not perfectly, perfectly round. It looks like it's just a touch oblong, but it's a beautiful color. So, Angela, you let me know. Are we keeping or are we canning? Thanks, Ange. She is deciding. It's really pretty. But totally up to you. Can it or keep it? It's pretty. Pretty. So, guys, if you give this video a thumbs up and let us know where you're watching from, you can be vague. You can say you're sitting in your living room watching us. Um, she wants to keep it. It's beautiful. I don't blame you. Congratulations. I just have to replace that one really quickly. Let me see what I have back here. Keep, keep, keep. Alrighty. Sometimes it makes it difficult. If I put a, another one in, I'm like, I don't know what other colors I have. So, but we'll see. Okay, so we're going to put that one in and Jay is going to mix them all around. So congratulations on your free pearl. I just got to send you a little message here. My pen doesn't work. Listen, where's our office manager? We need an office supplies. I need to, um, I need to, um, <laughs> what I going to say. All right, so, Angela, let's put this on here. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Wow, right my mind. I know That's you. scary. 
You Still sick in bed, but in Hawaii. I wish I was sick in bed in Hawaii. <laughs> right. When I just Dude, dealt we with... We can't really feel too sorry for Jana because she lives in Hawaii. Like, Jana, and grows her own fruits. I'm going to get in the car now just... and start driving to Hawaii with some chicken soup. Aww. Like, All right, Angela, thank me you so while. much for your order. We really appreciate it. You're going into our Easter giveaway. If we get up to five orders tonight, you're going into our mystery hostess. I don't know if you know, but you won mystery hostess last time. I don't think you were still on by the time our show ended. Um, so you won our beautiful bag last time. Hopefully my car floats. Tonight's, uh, tonight will be a $50 gift card. Like I said, if we get up to five orders, we have three orders so far, um, which means we need two more in order to activate that mystery hostess. So, guys, if you want to order, you can. JerseyGirlPearls.com. Mother's Day's coming up. We have confirmations coming up. Um, graduations. Easter, graduation. You probably can, birthdays. You can buy me a pearl My for birthday's graduate. coming up. So we, I'm not buying you a pearl. You're not? No. All right. Someone give him the skillet. So, typically, so I won't be here for, so I'll be here for my birthday. We get back, if you guys don't remember... My brother and sister are twins, so, um, and their birthday is the day before mine, but we're three years apart. Does that make sense? Uh, like, Jan, it might take me about two and a half months to get there, but. Um, so we always have always celebrated together. So um, I will give a shout out to my sister really quick. I don't know if she is still on, um, but if she is, she was inducted into the Hall of Fame for her college for softball. There we go. So, I'm a terrible sister because I am missing it. But give her a thumbs up because she might still be on. I don't know if she's still on. So, she's in the Hall of Fame. She's being inducted. And, of course, I didn't know the date. So, when I booked our our spring vacation, totally booked it over. Like, had no idea. Like, it was early enough that I didn't even realize it was that month. So, I'm a terrible sister. But she's okay. She's okay. <laughs> it's me. I'm like, no, I'm missing it. So, I'm missing it. But, anyways... So our birthdays are uh, a day apart. So I we come back from vacation. On, my birthday is April 30th. Theirs is the 29th. We come back the 28th. So we're literally coming off the ship celebrating because everybody will be here because of my sister's induction to the Hall of Fame because I'm an asshole. So, um, the language. So <laughs> I'm so mad at myself. Um, so everybody will be here. So we're literally going to get off the boat and then like celebrate with everyone. So when we come back, we will celebrate my birthday on here for a show just so you know we usually do it's just that our timing is so off this year <laughs> our, our timing is so off so we're saying congratulations to you Ange, for the hall of fame girlfriend oh. she says stop <laughs> oh oh because i'm mad at myself you mean oh. i know i feel bad i just booked something that i can't even attend your my own dad's, birthday party your dad's birthday is the 30th That's oh a he's a taurus love it April says hi, watching from Nova Scotia. Canadia, hi, what's up, Thanks April? Thanks for watching us. Everybody get, say hi to April. I got fam in Montreal. She knows I feel bad that I'm missing it, but... Janice Hubby is in the Hall of Fame for baseball. He he, he also pitched for... The, did you mean that he pitched for the Astros? That's pretty amazing. Oh, really? My sister... Um, was a pitcher as well. Did I say that? I must have for you to. So somebody say that. I went to high school with pitches for them now. Yeah, that's weird. Did did he pitch for the Astros? Is that what you mean? Because Jay's high school friend pitches for the Astros now. Isn't that funny? That's right? a small world. Yeah, I think it's the Astros. He yeah, that's for. what he posted, right? So exciting. <laughs> so Angela, thank you so much for your order. Um, so we will celebrate my birthday when um, when I come back. And then, of course, uh, Jason's in July. So um, I have to tell everybody ahead of time so we can get those birthday cards yeah. in for him. Yeah. Because he <laughs> he likes those cards. Wow, that is so, so cool, Jana. We are a baseball, softball family. Grew up watching pretty well. My parents are sports fanatics. So they literally watch everything from golf, tennis to baseball football every everything you can imagine so my mom and i know i've said this before but we're the ones that were like we're outside playing you know back in the 80s and 90s um when we're outside <laughs> we can literally my mother's the one that everybody hears yelling because the basketball game's on and she's you know rooting for them so it's just you know before everybody you know 
yeah, before the, everybody yeah, the measles and couldn't get, get <laughs> the you measle know, outbreak that's here. Get, get sick walking out of the house. Yeah. You know, forget about drinking out of the hose and playing. I with always drink out of the hose. Eating dirt and playing outside. Oh my goodness. Opening day. I know it was opening day here too. Um, I know that my niece had softball. Um, did you almost trip like into the? Yeah, I almost fell. I almost fell. I know. I almost, <laughs> folks. I almost went down. We almost had a. I fall and I can't get up. Moment. No, he wouldn't have fallen onto the ground. He literally would have fallen onto this table. He tripped and almost took Con out everything. Concussion. Right here. <laughs> Trauma. Um, my niece had. I think my niece, yeah. My niece had opening day today. They had pictures, like softball pictures. So I got to see those. I love baseball too, Becky. I love it. Love it. There's nothing so, you know, for so for me, we listen to the Dodgers. So we would go to church on Sunday. After church, we'd be in the car. Like this is just, um, and we would listen to the Dodgers. And I'm really drawing a blank on who my favorite announcer is right now. Marty. No, who's my favorite announcer for the Dodgers? Why am I drawing a blank? If my mother was on, she'd be so mad at me. I'll think of it. And I just know his voice. His voice is very comforting to me. So we would listen to the Dodgers on the way home, and then we'd have lunch when we got home from church, and then the baseball game would be on. And in California, it was warm, and uh, we had, like, a outside in the backyard, we had a wind chime. It was a wooden one, I think. So the with the warm, the baseball season, the wood chime, I don't know. Just, it's, like, the best. I don't know if anybody else has memories of that, but that's what I remember. A Philly fan. Oh. Cubs fan. Oh my goodness. April, what did you do today that you were so exhausted? Finally going to Fenway this summer to watch the Yankees. Hopefully, of course. Oh my gosh, there would be no other reason ever to enter Fenway. Unless the Yankees were going there to beat them. Eden, what's up? Hi, Eden. How is that baby? Um, I don't know if you guys saw, um, those of you that are part of our VIP club, but Shannon had her baby either today or yesterday. And she's beautiful. They're doing great. Mom and baby are doing great. Um, and she posted a picture. <laughs> so cute. So, so cute. Dark, dark, dark hair. Full head of hair. So take a peek there. So, guys, we have a VIP club for our Jersey Girl Pearls. Um, on Facebook, on the left-hand side, there's um, groups. If you click on that, you have to ask to join. There's a couple questions to answer. Ask to join, and then we will accept you. Um, we're also on Instagram, at Jersey Girl Pearls. We're on Pinterest, Jersey Girl Pearls. We're on YouTube, Jersey Girl Pearls. So um, follow us on our platforms. We would love to see you there. I did not. Where did you send it to? April, you do treatments for your sickness. Do you want to say what that is? Um, and it drains you. I got you, girl. Any... I don't know what it's for, but treatments I can imagine are very draining. Janice is Mariners. Oh, all right, so getting so grown turned two months. Oh my gosh. You probably sent it to Jen. I don't see. Two months last Tuesday. Can you believe it's going so fast? Oh my gosh. You don't have to do an updated picture. Yeah, I don't have anything on my thing. Probably probably went to Jen's thing. I can't see hers. So. Guys, don't forget that. So show me later. Every single order that we get goes into a drawing for a mug. Just like my mug here. But this one is a beautiful lilac color. Ocean shells and mermaid spells. Sterling. It's sterling silver inside. It is stainless steel inside. Wow. You're getting one of our brand new necklaces that just reminds me I have not put it on the site yet. We have one of our brand new necklaces plus five oysters. Let's take it off my ring there. Um, so everybody that orders between now, it's actually like two shows ago and up through May is going into the drawing for this. So fun. It keeps your, so I hear this ice in there. This has been since this morning. I'm an ice chewer, so I probably chewed up to here and I love lemon ice water like that's fine she'll show me later lemons in here organic lemons in here ice water it keeps my water cold all day long my ice is right at that point where it's so like i just took a bite and it would just dissolve ice, in my mouth ice <sighs> baby sorry jenna so anyways cup here and if trish is on trish won a, one of our mugs or tumblers earlier in the year um or it might have been at the end of last year she loves it 
She can attest to it. Oh, sure. Trisha, she needs the cup for her coffee. I keep walking into things. Because the other one's for your water? <laughs> Christina is a Cubs fan. 47-year fan. Um, okay. Pika, I know. I know. I think it means that we're missing something. Like iron? No, it's like vitamin E. I don't know. But I am an ice chewer. I could just chew ice all day long. What are... Oh, my gosh, guys. What are you doing? Can we there? get on with the show? If, oh, Please. I can't. Can't. Oh, my Lord. Put your clothes back on. <laughs> all right, guys. So, Karen Kulish, you're not on, right? It's about 16 below zero in the house. All right. So, Karen Kulish, we have a board pick for you. You are not on. Linda, let's see. I got an order from you. I thought you'd you, chew ice when your iron's low. I don't have any oyster openings for Linda's order, but... She got all jewelry, so we are going to um, still do the. Um, you just want me to go to work. Board pick and the wheel spin. Actually, I don't have to do this. There's no discount codes used. So, Linda P, are you on? Linda Petrovich. Ice, ice, no oyster openings, but I have all jewelry ordered, so that still qualifies for the board. You're going to get a board pick and a wheel spin. Uh, I didn't know what you meant the way you said it. We pronounce it pika. You say pika? You say pika. The hashtag, hi Christina, how's your mom doing? The hashtag it, tonight is pearls. And yeah, we say pika. You say pika? Pika. I could see it could be either one. Mineral. Yeah, like it's a mineral we're missing. Yeah. Trish has one for coffee, one for ice water. Oh my goodness. So we would love if you shared our video. It helps us get our name out. If you do uh, share, use the hashtag pearls so that we know that you shared. Um, we are, I don't think you can't see above us, but if you are not part of our texting club, we give, um, we give you a phrase pearl party to text to 31996. That will get you a text about two hours before our show starts just to let you know that we're starting. Sometimes uh, Facebook's algorithm doesn't always let you know when we are live. So we do have a texting service. It's about four texts a month. Uh, not even like this month, you will have already gotten all that you're gonna get for this month since we're gone on vacation. Um, I There is a small chance that we'll have a show on Tuesday. If this guy lets me, he already gave me a weirdo look. Um, but just cause we're going on vacation. So he's like, no. depending on work. So Probably it takes not. two really to do a party because I need someone behind the camera. So if he's not available, I won't be able to do it. Okay. What's next boss? Oh, so Karen says she's only heard of Pika too. What? That is so weird. Well, we say Pika. What do you say? Like if you're chewing something that is not food, you know how like some people have uh, like a like a pica disorder where they eat like I don't know what the hell you're talking about like right dirt now. or ice ice isn't actually like a nutritional no listen where I grew up okay. we didn't talk about these things so I have no idea what you're talking about okay <laughs> it's over Jason all right so is Linda Petrovich on Linda Sorry, I'm just that, ordered and I'm I want to make sure that she gets her board pick and her wheel spin because she didn't order small. any oysters but she ordered uh, a few pieces of jewelry here. So I Linda mean, Petrovich. Where I came from, if you were chewing on something un normal, we would just say you were effed up. We'd just say it. That's what we would say. Like, what's wrong with that guy? <laughs> <laughs> but would you say that if they were chewing ice? No. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> so what are you talking about? If, oh, you're eating, if you're eating dirt, we'd be like, what's wrong with that guy? He's eating dirt. Look. Right, but some people, or like paint, I don't know. Okay. Well, if you're eating paint chips, you got an issue. But there, it's a disorder, so I don't want to, you don't want to say it. Moving on. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I don't have a filter. And did he say, he must have said pica. It's weird that we say pica. Pica. All right, so Linda Petrovich. Every time Petrovich, you say pica, I think of going to Chili's and getting a dip. Oh, Pete, like, oh, like Pico de Gallo? 
Can we get back onto pearls, please? <laughs> I don't know what's going on right now. All right, so right now, the only th we don't have any active orders. Um, I do have Linda Petrovich, who just put an order in, just no oyster openings. She ordered jewelry alone, but she's um, up for a board pick and a wheel spin. So if Linda's here, just say that you're here so that we can, um, can we can do that for you. And then Karen Cullis is the same thing. She put an order for preset jewelry. Guys, we do have some pieces left for preset. We will be um, doing some more presets and putting them up there, um, especially with a bunch of um, holidays coming up. So... Um, Karen will get a board pick if she's on. And I did talk to her today and she said that she was going to pop on. But I know that life gets super busy. So I'm just going to keep saying their names until somebody says here. So Linda Petrovich and Karen Cullis, we are waiting to do um, the board pick and the wheel spin for you guys. My mom is a huge ice cruncher, and the noises drive me insane. So when I was younger, my mother... Um, is that good for your teeth? No, it's probably terrible for my teeth. Um, my mother was an ice chewer as well. So she would fill up her cup of ice in the morning, put water over it so it, like, softened, um, and literally eat it the whole way, like, to school and work and everything. I don't know. <laughs> I just love it. Love it, love it. And this, cu this tumbler is the best thing for it. Right, sure. It's like right at that good stage. I don't even know if you can see that. Like where they're soft. All you need to do is. Right. Mm, so what's next, boss? It. Right now I don't have any orders. Well, bosses, so if you would like to I order. I should say, what's next, bosses? <laughs> is everyone else your boss? <laughs> Everybody here. Yeah, yeah? absolutely. JerseyGirlPearls.com. You can um, put in your orders there. We'll open your oysters live. Um, we'll hang out for a few minutes. I'll have Jay show you some jewelry pieces. I wanted to make sure that we are showing you all of our new pieces. I'll have him show you. Guys, here is the sterling silver. This is Joyful Heart. It's a cage pendant. Sorry, that our this is what I got to stop trying to wait for this to stop. What is that? There we go. It's something I was trying to get. Okay, so this over here going over here. Doing this kind of go down. Okay, get in there. Okay. A perverted appetite for substances not fit as food or with no nutritional value. Clay, dried paint, starch. Okay, so but do they say pipe they do say pica or or pica. So it's it's we're both right. It's pica or pica. Look at that. Hi Karen. We we you have a board pick, Karen, so we're gonna do your board pick in just one second. You are good. I held off because I knew you would pop on. Okay. Hi, Deborah. How are you? What movie are you about to see? I want to watch Mary Poppins. I know. No. We might be able to tonight. I don't want to get Mary Peppin confused, but Mary Poppins. This one's pretty cool right here with the colors. Ooh, look at the pretty colors. Guys, I want to show you in our preset or under earrings, we have these gorgeous pearls. Look at the size so of those They're things. 11 to 12 millimeters. They so you're gonna say, hey, Kelly, oh my gosh, they doing? look huge, but they're 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 normally normal big sized pearls. So I don't want to put them in my ear, um, but I want to just kind of show you. These are phenomenal. So the, we do have the regular our sizes for our saltwater pearls are usually between five and eight point five millimeters. So Akoyas can get up to nine millimeters. So these ones are eleven to twelve absolutely stunning we have these in preset and under um and under earrings but take a look at them they are so beautiful thanks i appreciate you waiting i'm sad i missed the meeting that's okay karen no problem i did a lot of talking today <laughs> Yeah, guys, don't forget, give this video a thumbs up. Tell us where you're watching from if you want to be eligible to win the last oyster of the night. So we have ivory pearls available, navy pearls, and lavender pearls in sterling silver that are already set. Those ones are either under preset or under earrings. So those are available as well. This is the biggest that we have. So when I say in the descriptions that the colors could be just slightly off, I mean, can you really see a difference? There might be one that's just a touch um, lighter or darker but nothing is um, crazy off so don't feel like you're gonna get like a dark one and a light one this is literally a pair of them but I wanted you to know that we are offering 
um, the bigger ones already set for you. So here we gotta go to are Alaska. some names. I want to go to Alaska one of these days. Kelly says, watch you from Alaska on my front porch. Just got home from work. South Africa. Thanks for watching, Kelly. How you doing Hi, from Chantel South? That's from awesome. South Africa. Four, Four in o'clock the in the morning. What are you still doing awake? She probably just, maybe she just woke up. Wow. Or you could still be <laughs> up from last night, right? So what Jay's going to show you is just the, um, the navy, um, button pearls. Those are the regular sizes. So I'll actually have him compare. So in just a second, so that's navy. We have navy, lavender, and ivory that are already set. Or we offer the sterling silver post, so you can put your own colors in. Um, somebody named Faith won the very, f I'm going to show um, you the difference in sizes. Someone named Faith won the first oyster of the night, and she got twins. And when I tell you they're beautiful, they are... Everybody, let's take bets. They are gorgeous seafoam greens. So these could be set in earrings. Who thinks that Jay's going to drop one of these things? <laughs> so that's the difference. We're just showing you the difference in size. Just well, Chantel, up, we're so God. glad you're here. Give Chantel a thumbs up. Welcome her for joining our show today at 4 in the morning. God bless you. Getting up that early. So that's the difference in size. So those are available as well. Let me show you a couple pieces here. So one of our most popular newer pieces, guys, is the Pearl Sunrise. And let me show you this. If you talk about what has my most hits on Pinterest and all of those, it is the Pearl Sunrise. So this is a sterling silver shell, like um, almost like an oyster shell um, that curls up around whatever color pearl you want to put in the middle there. We have set so many of these. They are beautiful. And when he comes back and he was giving the dog a little more food, um, it's stunning. It's an absolutely beautiful piece. We have set it in all sorts of colors. Um, that is our Pearl Sunrise. So guys, orders are wide open. JerseyGirlPearls.com. You can put in orders there. We will open your oysters live. We will not be here for two weekends in a row. We're so sad about that. Um, but you have plenty of time tonight if you would like to order. Here is our Trinity. This is actually in our preset section. This one exactly. This is the purple one. So you have a sugar plum purple. You have a white here that has a touch of blush pink on it. And you have a royal purple down there. So, Jay, if you maybe want to go like this, this is our Trinity. This is available. This exact one or I can just with the this. purples set is available under preset. And then, of course, summer is coming up. All of our Hawaii fans. We have a beautiful Plumeria. This actual one is available in this color. It's under presets. Sterling silver Plumeria set with like a fuchsia color like a light cranberry color. So that exact one is available under preset or we can set any color pearl in the plumeria under sterling silver. So that is a beautiful trinity for our purple lovers there. Let me just see newer ones. Our wildflowers is new with our diamond cage. To see what else is in there. Yeah. Dropping pearls. Two of our newer cages, our wildflowers actually holds two. So it's almost like an egg shape. Um, sterling silver has uh, flowers and vines, holds two pearls in there. So our key to my heart is newer. Isn't it funny, this little, um, what is this, the paper clip that Jay made to hold these up? It works, right? So the key to my heart is beautiful. Sterling silver, high quality CZs around. Your pearl goes right in the middle. And I'm also putting it next to our sterling silver anchor cage. And then I know someone was asking about the playful pup before. Let me see if I can find that one. So we do have silver plated available. So what you're seeing is all sterling, but let me show you a couple of our silver plateds. 
They are beautiful. We'll give you, let's see, it is baseball season, so I'll give you the home run with the playful pup. And maybe Jay can show you what it looks like on both sides, because your pearl is front and center. He's physically playing with the dog right now. <laughs> All right, so those ones are plated. And I'll show you two more pleated as well. Actually, three. Very nice. We're going to do Karen's board pick in just one second. Let me just show you these three uh, plated. We have wine time. We have the rose. And we have a beautiful starfish. Those ones are plated as well. So, guys, just for reference. So, these have been sitting out here because I, well, I have so many set pieces, obviously, because we, have so, we offer so much jewelry. Um, but those are plated, so they've been sitting out. They've been encountered all sorts of weather, and they really haven't changed color at all because I know some people um, get concerned about the plated, but they've been sitting out literally. I have one that's been sitting out for two and a half years that has never turned. It's still sitting over here. So those are plated ones. All right, so I am going to do a board pick for Karen if Karen is still on. Karen did order. She ordered one of our presets. Um, so... There's no oyster openings tonight, but she still qualifies for um, board picks. So Karen, if you are here, our boards are Blossoms and Bunnies. So I'm gonna show you up close and then you just let me know what number under which title. So that's our Bunnies. And here's our Blossoms. And Jay, can you share again? Yeah. Thanks. So if Karen is here, I will have her choose which one. So every $65 you spend, you get a board pick. So board picks have free oysters, uh, percentages off, free shipping, a wheel spin we saw earlier. Um, I can't remember everything that's on there, but there's tons of things on there. So our gift cards and stuff never expire. So oh, you can get cash on here, um, whatever it is. So um, every $65, so if you spend $65 or $130, you get two. Um, if you spend $150, you get a board pick and a wheel spin. A wheel spin has a bunch of games on it, um, Jersey Girl Pearl Cash, um, yeah, prizes, that kind of stuff is on the wheel. She wants bunnies number nine. Bunnies number nine. So that is why I didn't send your stuff right away because I wanted to make sure that we, so we have 10 extra entries. So it'll actually go in, so this is actually gonna go in for our spring um, giveaway. So you're getting 10 extra entries into the spring giveaway because you were a pre-order, you ordered before the show started. Also, you're getting an additional 10 now because um, that's what you just won, but let me show you what it is. So it is our tumbler. if you didn't see it before. You're gonna get basically 20 entries, 21 entries into this. Um, the drawing will be in May, so everybody that orders between now and then gets into here. There's plenty of opportunity to get extra entries. It says Ocean Shells and Mermaid Spells. It is so glitterly, glitterly, glittery and beautiful. We have our name on the back. It is stainless steel. It is so wonderful. It is just like mine. Um, and Trish got the other one that we gave away before. You're getting one of our brand new necklaces. It has got fresh water pearls on it and beads. You can wear it as a double. The camera isn't high enough for you guys to see it up top today. Um, I had Jay at a weird angle earlier. So um, so this necklace, I'll have Jay show it She didn't have me at a weird angle. She had the camera at a weird angle. I had him at a weird angle. My back still hurts from it. <laughs> so that necklace is there. Still can't um, get my leg down. Plus you're going to get five... Um, oysters whoever the winner is there you go. so that's there so you're gonna get 10 extra entries into here my friend congratulations nine bunnies did we pick i did okay that's what we're talking about uh <laughs> my brain all right so let me put this on your thing here so you're getting 10 um plus 10 entries was your was your board pick okay congratulations you're welcome thank you so much for your order so if linda petrovich pops on she has um a wheel spin and a board pick if she pops on if we see her if linda if you hear your name being called 
Here I'll have Jay show you guys. This one here is our elephant, which holds up to two. We have our mother of dragons and we have our Lila's paw, all sterling silver. Hold on. Oh my God, I'm talking to myself, sorry. You're talking to it? Absolutely coffee is needed. You probably need coffee. Four in the morning, right? So our, um, our filigree cross sterling silver pendant is for sale. Um, should I say for sale? It is on sale. Um, so it is on sale on the site still. We have not taken that sale down. We have a lot of things like Easter and communion and um, confirmation and stuff that are coming up. So this is available as well. Great for aunts, godmothers, nieces, Excuse granddaughters, me. grandmothers, daughters. Um, it's beautiful. It's a cage Ooh. pendant. A cage pendant simply means you open it up. Your pearl fits inside. You close it and then your chain locks it in place. So with that chain that goes down the middle, it's never opening. So that is in place, but you can interchange your pearl colors with cage pendants. So a lot of these ones that you've seen that Jay has just showed you are cage pendants. They open up, you can change it depending on your outfit. Um, our beautiful anchor, we're going on a cruise, that'll be perfect for that. If I'm wearing navy, if I'm wearing white, whatever it is, I could just interchange the pearls that I have. So you don't always have to purchase jewelry with every single pearl that you have you can build your collection and then you can use them and interchange them with your cage pendants um and of course what i didn't bring out today which i really wanted to was um the mother's embrace because i've gotten a lot of inquiries about that one um and i've showed it a lot this week but i bet you i don't have it sitting here let me have jay show you the adeline ring guys we have so many oh i didn't even show you the mother's day necklace so this okay so don't be alarmed if this pearl comes out i did not set this one yet this is our new sterling silver mom it's called motherly love necklace great just in time for mother's day also though a mother's embrace if you are on our website just type in mother's embrace or um go to the mother's day at the top and it will have not only this but the very first one i think on there is the mother's embrace it's a cage pendant it has a mom and a and a baby on there or a mom and a child it's an interchanging of pearls um for that one as well eden says she has the mother's embrace we have gotten just such positive feedback from that one's like an original we've had that one for two years so um it is a classic it is loved by all the mother's embrace so if you're ever looking for something you're not quite sure what to get someone either that is a new mom someone that's expecting someone that has been a mom forever um, a godmother an aunt whatever it is beautiful gift sterling silver interchange the pearls and you can also send so we've sent that one I've said this before but we've sent that one a lot as a gift so if you if someone is having a girl you can put a pink pearl in it having a boy you can put a blue you can put whatever pearl color you want in there um, but it's very popular this motherly love is brand new literally last show we debuted it um, so this one will come uh, with your pearl drilled right in the middle of the word mom yes yeah, so e exactly so Eden got hers in remembrance of her angel baby from last year which I remember but um, yeah so it's special so what one of the biggest things that's so meaningful for our company is that memories are made um, from the jewelry that we carry so not just the experience of hey we're opening oysters or we're revealing pearls and my granddaughter's on and my daughter's on and I'm, I'm ordering this for my daughter I'm ordering this for my wife and you're building those experiences that way but just the meaning of the jewelry that you get because I remember pretty much every piece of jewelry I've ever gotten from anyone I remember like that and I'm sure I'm not the only one um, so special it's special memories with certain pieces so I totally get that and we love to build those memories with our customers so not just opening the oysters and, and experiencing you know finding your pearl that is exciting but it's also lasting memories those people will always remember the jewelry that you gave them or you'll always remember the reason you bought a piece of jewelry okay I think I <laughs> before I turn emotional but yes so yes exactly Eden um, but I don't have it out here because I'm a jerk and last time I was like oh I need to make sure I have it here and of course I don't have it sitting here and I probably do it's probably right in front of my face but just 
because there's so many pieces. So another option, guys, um, is our Charmed, this one's Charmed Life, right? So Charmed Life is a sterling silver bracelet. It's amazing because you also might have pieces that you don't wear every day. So maybe you have five or six cage pendants, even drilled settings. Take a look at this. These are, they're silver balls on both ends. It's sterling silver, the balls come off. You just simply, I'll show you. <laughs> you just simply unscrew them, but where did I drop it? Um, and then they move on and off. So here, this is the- I'm the, leaving that one alone, folks. This is the pineapple. I missed it, because I, well, I don't see it yet. The pineapple sterling silver cage pendant. So I'm just putting it on there because you might have a few that you don't wear every day, but you do want to wear them. So we can put them on this beautiful bracelet. So you can purchase the bracelet and then as you grow your collection, you can put them on here. We do have charms in the add-on section. You can put bail pearls on there. Under add-on, there's something called bales. Those are sterling silver bales that we drill into the top of the pearl so that you can actually put those on anything. You can add them to necklaces. You can add them to bracelets. If Jay could hold that straight. Technical <laughs> difficulties. You'd be able to see that. Okay. Guys, I, did, I actually physically forgot to show you our most popular. Uh, this is how you know it's real. Silver this plate. Is not, this is not TV. <laughs> what? I can't hold them straight. You it's crazy. Um, so this is actually one of our most popular plated's that I forgot to show. It's our love pendant. So the the O in love is shaped as a heart. You know, right over there. Yep. Mm -hmm. And that's a, and that's what it looks like. So that's available too under plated. So guys, if you want to order tonight, you can Jersey Girl Pearls. That was really mm -hmm. quick. Do they see it? Mm -hmm. JerseyGirlPearls.com. If you order oysters, we can open them live now. Here is our. We have a couple. I don't know if we want to see more. <laughs> like that? <clears throat> yeah, I can see that love one. All right, we have lots and lots of choices. Every price point is on there. We have from charms to keychains to rings to earrings to bracelets. Stop. He's being so fresh behind the camera. Oh my goodness. Here's our light as a feather. Also very, very popular. What did I do with your... I'll show you with the infinity and the dream catcher. I've closed the dream catcher. I've closed this into the dream catcher. Okay. All right, I'll show you one more. I don't know. Oh, there it is. I was wondering where the paper clip is, and of course, it's attached to a piece of jewelry. around we have our dream catcher which holds multiples that's sterling silver all these are sterling silver dream catcher holds many our light as a feather holds one right on top and then we have our infinity drill pendant so take a peek at that all right we will wait just a couple more minutes to see if there are any more orders coming in did you show the adeline ring did you show that one I can't remember if I handed it to you. <laughs> That's our Adeline. It's an adjustable sterling silver. Ranges in sizes, I believe, from six to nine comfortably. You could open or squeeze it closed to make it larger or smaller. Gosh, guys, there are so many options. And before we, we go, I have to show this one because Easter is approaching. This is our cottontail. Did I show this one before? Sterling silver cottontail. She is adorable. Any color pearl can go right in her belly. <laughs> Did he drop her? Jumped. Oh, she she hopped away. Mm -hmm. So we'll have Jay look one more time to see if there's any more orders. Linda Petrovich, if you are on, we will do a wheel spin and a board pick for you. If not, we will do it on our next show. One board pick and one wheel spin alrighty so Jay is just going to check orders now okay alrighty so if we have no more orders we will maybe draw this to a close we will do last oyster of the night so last oyster of the night will go to someone who 
uh, gave this video a thumbs up and let us know where they were watching from. Um, and then what happens is if you are the winner of the last oyster of the night, the only thing that you have to do is send me a private message with your email address and your actual mailing address so that we can send you that uh, free pearl. Also guys, if you ever win from us, you get free shipping. So that um, is just another added bonus. If you wanted to um, order a piece of jewelry, you do not have to by any means, but if you wanted to, it would be part of that free shipping package. So if you win an, an oyster or a pearl and you're like, oh, just hold it for me, I wanna choose jewelry, let me know that. If you're not gonna look for jewelry at all, just send me a message and say, send me my pearl and we will send it to you. But just remember to send me your address and your um, email address so you can get the tracking. All right, I think that's about it. I think that's it. I don't think we have any more orders for tonight. Do we have a, we have a quick show tonight? We've only been, on, so we've only been on two hours. That's half the time that we're normally on. That is crazy. So we do have time if anybody else wants to order. <laughs> James like, am I doing this or am I not doing this? He's gonna check. We're gonna check one more time. Everybody has gone quiet. Is it just quiet on my end? Or are you quiet over there also? Are we, are we good? Yeah, we're good. We're good. All right, guys. So we're going to give you... Uh, Amy says, did you... Yes, Amy, it's on its way to you. I think I messaged you back and said, yes, we had it. But just check, um, check your email for the tracking. It should almost be to you. I think we sent it out maybe Thursday. We did have it. If I'm holding a pearl for you, like if you were a winner and you actually want it, if I'm keeping it, I might think that you want me to hold it. And if you, if I have it and you want me to send it, let me know you want me to send it. No problem, Amy. All right, guys. So just so you know, we're going to do the last oyster of the night right now. So someone's going to get a free pearl and free shipping. Um, but we will be gone for the next two weekends. We just want to tell you that ahead of time. Um, normally we are on either Friday or Saturday, but we will be gone. So we will have a show as soon as we get back, which will be that first weekend in May. So don't miss us too much. We'll try to post pictures. Okay. Ready? Jay's like, I'm right, ready to do go. last oyster of the night. Ready? Robin Thompson. Robin Thompson. Are you here? So I don't even see it yet. I'm still looking Robin at Robin Thompson. Oh, crooked. I can't. It's so funny. My delay is so bad. I'm still talking. Like from before. <clears throat> there. Okay. There's his phone. He's saying Robin Thompson. Is there a Robin? Oh, there it is. Robin Thompson. Are you here? Robin Thompson must have given our video a thumbs up and told us where she was watching from. So Robin, if you are here, Robin Thompson, you have won a free pearl on us. So we'll give uh, Robin just a minute to answer. If not, guys, you have to tell me, am I opening a classic or a bright for her? I don't know if she's still on. Let me write her name down. Robin Thompson is the winner of the last oyster. I always forget to put the date on here. So let me do 413. Thank you, Kim. Thank you. Right. Um, last Can I? oyster, 413. Okay, and then the timestamp is 2 hours and 12 minutes. Thank you, guys. Thank you, April. All right, Kelly says, Bright, am I pulling a bright for her? Mm -hmm. Bright, bright, bright. Okay, let me just pull one out of here. Away from my face. <laughs> I was trying to save my nails for vacation, so I'm going to wear two gloves. All right, so this is for Robin Thompson. She is the winner of a free pearl from us tonight. Let's see what we get here. The most exciting thing about our vacation is that we get to come home to a new bathroom. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? My poor parents have to sit here during that. We are looking at a beautiful harvest orange. It's stunning. Let me make sure there's no twins in there. Away from my face. Very juicy and meaty. The luster on here is amazing. All right, let's measure. 
7.0. So Jay is going to come show you really close up. He says he's coming. He's coming. Oh my gosh. I just, I just dropped it. All right. Did we heard it. It's over there. It's over there. In front of the fan on the ground. Yikes. Leave it to me to give a little excitement. So I was trying to, um, you know, clean it off and it flew. Okay. That's not it. <laughs> I must have dropped another one at a time. At another time. Darn it. I was wondering how it got all the way over there. All right. It's a beautiful, it's a beautiful one. So. I don't know what to tell you. It's, it's right under your chair. It's under my chair? So why don't you just, yeah, it's under your chair. Okay. Why would you. Oh no, it's in, it's in front of the, you have to get on your hands and knees. I don't know why you would do that. <laughs> I was kicking it to you thinking that you'd be able to just. No, I don't know where it is now. It's right in front of the gray box. All right, I'm making him get on his hands and knees. Thank you, my love. He's like, yeah, no. <laughs> he literally had to get on, hit on his hands and knees. Everybody give him a thumbs up. All right, let me, I was like, they actually don't like a roll. Okay, here we go. All right, Jay, you ready to show it? It is a beautiful, beautiful harvest orange. I, so when I thought I was like kicking it to him, I forgot there was like a huge tub that the um, tripod's sitting on. So it literally sat in front of the tub. It's gorgeous, beautiful orange. I'm gonna call it a harvest orange. Helping you get your exercise. <laughs> literally hands and knees. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. So Robin Thompson, congratulations on your free oyster. Um, I don't think that color, I don't think that is doing it justice. I'm just looking at the color now. I did have Jay turn one of the studio lights over there around because I felt like it was so bright. Um, so I feel like that might be one of the reasons why it is not coming up as bright. All right, guys. So we are going to miss you guys terribly. I will try to put up pictures. I don't know how much internet um, access we're going to have, but I'm here like for the next four days. So um, if you guys need anything, if you have any questions, you can send me messages. You can still order anything like presets and stuff like that. You're going to get, um, you'll get this week. If you, if you order, then I'll mail them to you. But if not, then anything that you guys order between now and we come back the 28th. So, uh, that week, that first week of May, which is my birthday week. So we'll probably go live at some point during that week. So anyways, that's about it guys. I think we're good for tonight. No more orders. Last oyster of the night done. Not enough for mystery hostess. <coughs> we were one order short, but that's about it. All right. <laughs> what, what do you want to say? Nothing. What, what was the look for? Nothing. No, no say is. <laughs> Am I talking too much? I'm trying to read his language. He's like, I can't. All right. All right, guys. Well, thank you for joining us for our show tonight. Um, make sure that you apply to be part of our VIP club. Make sure you like and follow our Facebook page. Um, make sure that you are liking our Instagram at Jersey Girl Pearls. If you are not part of Instagram, please sign up. You need to be part of Instagram. It is such a fun world and such a fun platform to be a part of. Um, so we're on there. We're on YouTube. And I was thinking about it today and I have not uploaded like our videos here to YouTube in like probably a month. So I need, I'm a little backlogged. So maybe I'll do that tonight. Um, so we have that. And then Pinterest guys, we're trying to be a little bit more active on that platform. So please come follow us on Pinterest. Just type in Jersey girl pearls and you should be able to find us. All right, guys have a great night. Thank you so much. Have a great rest of your weekend. Thank you for your orders. And then if you are waiting to get pictures from jewelry, um, or from, if you're waiting to get pictures of pearls for jewelry, <laughs> Um, then send me a message and then we'll make sure that we're on the same page. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Yeah, we're going to have fun, hopefully be able to relax. So, all right guys, have a great night. See you, later. See you later. Bye. Bye.